What's up everybody and welcome to my next challenge run, which is not of this game, but this series of games. Specifically the first six, Mega Man 1 through 6, Mega Buster only. I am your host, Richard Reviver, and let's press start, because that's what the game seems to want us to do. I'm not sure how loud this is in the audio balancing right now, but it looks just fine to me. Okay, so also I'm gonna also say hello to my mouse. It's very nice, I know. Um, so let's get to it. We're gonna start off with Gus Man because this way we can really we just wanna take as little visits as possible to Elect Man. So yeah, we're gonna do one visit to it. Plus, Gus Man's actually one of the easier robot masters in my opinion. Okay, let's wait because that does not look good. Shout out to like these freaking cable car noises taking away all sound effects. But yeah, this is actually the I think this is the third time I've been trying to uh, try to try to record this. Like this this first episode specifically. I haven't had any specific problems with the other recordings, I just don't like how they turned out. Okay. So yeah, I just plan to take on Elect Man today, because he is the hardest robot master. Well, that was all for nothing. I tried, okay, cool. Okay, it's big eye time. That wasn't as bad as I was expecting, honestly. And since this is a Mega Buster only, of course, the me is pretty self explanatory of the challenges for this. It's to beat the entire game with using only exclusively the Mega Buster, unless. I can't. I mean, we're going to be breaking that challenge pretty shortly by using the Guts Arm, or whatever it's called. Okay, that was all me, I'll be honest, because I am not good at this game. I mean, it's a Mega Man game, these games are pretty hard to begin with. I mean, I actually never finished, what's it called? I never finished 10, because it was because I just couldn't. I got to like the second last boss and just threw in the towel eventually. That's how it should have been the first time. <laughs> Pretty easy, right? Okay, let's, uh, don't know what's up with my glitchy text hit there, but okay. But now that's that done, let's go to Woodluck Man, because this is the one boss I've been fearing for the... I'm fearing for this game specifically. And he's the best song from this game. Already. I hope I can get up there, though, because this is going to be a lot harder than it should be. There we go. That's an awful I'll move my mouse, because that should not be here in the first place. I tried. Okay, cool. Thank you. 
Okay. This is the invisible walk part. This is a pretty easy pattern. There. I've played this game enough to actually memorize all the patterns. Well, except Iceman, so I found a way because I just cheese that by using the freaking magnet beam. Excuse me, what the fuck? Okay, at least I at least hope that I can get the freaking magnet beam on this run. And then after that, I can just... And then after that, home free. No, just piss off, would you? Thank you. This is the magnet beam. Technically, it is possible to get the magnet beam without the guts on, but... It means doing like a zip glitch, and I'm not exactly sure on how to do it. <laughs> I forgot about that. Alright, this is more these things up. Okay, nope. I love the NES sprite flickering that's happening. Perfect. Time for the worst part of the level right here, big eye. Wait, is it this room? It is indeed this room, okay. <laughs> we did it! <laughs> Time for the worst part of the stage, which is a like man himself. I remember seeing a video of how someone did it, but I can't remember their strategy, so let's go again. Actually, remember it involves a box on the right. And now I remember it. Because that did a few. Okay, let's go, we like man. Round two. Uh, and because. This is because I'm just doing the stage again. I'll see you back at Electman. <sighs> that was terrifyingly close. Okay, let's go. That's not good. If he gets up here, I'm pretty fucked. Let's say that. I think that's the strategy, at least that's... I don't remember using that, but yeah.
Illichman's actually the only boss in this game I haven't beaten. Uh, Bustless. Come on, go up. What are you doing facing that way? I was holding right. Okay, I'm gonna look that video up real quickly, so do not mind me while I cheat. Okay, so that's that. So what was being used is more or less what I was doing, but something different at the same time. Because <laughs> this boss is an absolute bitch, and I'm putting that politely. Dude, I... <sighs> he wait what he jumps when I shoot Time to go back I am not ending this episode until I defeat a like man. Even if it means this episode is one hour long. I mean, I've already had hour long videos on my channel before, so it wouldn't be so it's not like it would be something new. Even though that isn't necessarily a good idea to have, but still. Alright, back to a like man. So even if I use it to my advantage, I still can't figure out when is a good time to freaking shoot them. They're just a generally hard boss. You're kidding. I'm gonna try taking him on head on. Just this one time. If it doesn't work, I'm just gonna like say fuck you to the game. This actually might be a challenge I can't complete, who knows? I might actually just come back and do Elect Man another day, because it's Elect Man. He's the one boss in this game I can't do with the Mega Master. I don't care, I'm gonna do this over and over again if I have to. <laughs> Fucking, I will eventually probably start save staging outside his boss room because I've proven how many times I can do this. I probably can't beat, probably can't beat him at this rate, but I can try.
Why is he always facing left even if I'm holding right? I cannot. Let's see. I'm I'm facing left. I'm facing right. Okay, there. Let's put on from the right side of the freaking lamp. Uh, ladder. <laughs> For a second, I also tend to say elevator. But honestly, though, I would rather like man just straight up runs into me rather than he used his special ability on me. There we go. Like man, I swear. Okay, let's go again. So there's a pattern to how he moves. He will always jump up there when he touches the wall, so that's good to know. I can't believe I noticed that just now. But hey, since I have full HP, now I'm in the know. Let's do this. Hopefully, let's like, let's actually do it. Okay, yep, that's that. Fuck this game, I hate it, I hate you all. Back at it with day two of Elec Man. Okay, here we go. Actually, I just remember I can stay on the left and do it. So he shoots electricity at um, certain spots, figured out that much. Actually, you know what? Doing this actually might be really helpful for it. Freaking, if someone can do this battle without getting damaged, I can do this. Fine.
Okay, we're gonna do it like this. The ultimate cheese strat. Don't know, I didn't think of this earlier. It's so safe too. Okay, that's just me being reckless, I'll admit that. The best part honestly that I said it's so safe after getting hit. Well, as I was getting hit. Well hey, at least we have a freaking pattern down for all the Wily refights too, so that's good. Okay, yeah, that was all me. I'll admit that. But hey! I've actually never been so happy to game over in my life, since now I actually know a good pattern to defeating him. So yeah, I'll see you back there. Back at it again at Krispy Kreme! Okay, good. So yeah, um, as you can tell, I'm actually right before the freaking Lekman area. There we go. I'm feeling really good about this specific run now, considering I know a way to do it. It's gonna be pretty hell though when I get to like the Mega Man, to like the later mans. Okay, wait, wait, no, there's one more screen, forgot about that screen. Let's see if we can get, quickly get the, uh, the cheap shot off. Because, yeah, I'm facing the wrong direction. That's good. That's not good. Okay, come on. Okay, yeah, that's just me being stupid. In any case, I'm back at full health. So let's do this seriously now. Okay, that was all me, being stupid. Okay, I have zero lives. Right. Zero lives, let's play this extra safe now. Why did I get careless at the end? Oh my god. Okay, let's just not fuck it up this time. How'd that sound for a plan? Sounds pretty flawless to me. But we also have to take into account that I'm human and that I'm prone to errors like this. So, let's see what happens. Fuck. Yeah, I fucked it up that time. All thought I took a bunch of damage. But a bit of bum. If you wonder why I keep checking over this way, because oh, my laptop is on charge and I want to take it off charge when it's full. Shocking, I know. Okay, I'm just going to do this. And if I change anything, it's, uh, that means I'm gonna die. Also means that's gonna I'm gonna have to die like that possibly. Hopefully it doesn't happen though.
That's the game. <sighs> Finally. And that was episode one, the Elect Man special. I know, pretty pretty weird to start off a series with a special, but that's that. <laughs> Thank goodness it's done. Oh, yes. And that concludes episode one. In the next episode, we are going to be taking up, tackling the rest of the Robot Masters. So, until then. I am Retro Reviver signing out, and I'll see you all next time. Take care, everybody.